you know guys welcome back to my channel today i want to be showcasing to you showing to you guys this brand new um, hold on, uh, this brand new ad we got from promo legend and after that we're going to be talking about why you should start saving up for uh, the anniversary for black friday slash christmas banner slash new year's banner so let's keep watching the video and discuss about it later okay guys so basically what you just saw was the ad for the brand new legends festival campaign they do this one every year when it happens once a year so then basically we can repeat these together so awesome rewards from the crystal which is pretty much very good but basically these guys are just telling us that we must start saving our crystals for black friday slash christmas slash new years just so that um uh, we have enough crystals because these they always do happiness i mean remember like last year the units for black friday was UI Goku plus the Pride Troopers and then Christmas was Broly and Gogeta these uh, Broly and Gogeta were <laughs> really phenomenal units then the UI uh, he was good on release on release all these guys were literally game breaking you can really run all of them on the same team same of course these two on God he these two on movies all three of them on the same deck they all just fit together and run perfectly well with each other and then yeah guys then let me just check last the year before that black friday i see um oh sorry uh a bit of back yeah guys like and then, like those three units especially the brilliant gojira age phenomenal well all three of them did age phenomenally well if i do say so myself then uh where was or this new year banner then i assume that these two were the black friday of the the previous year <coughs> these guys were really phenomenal when they came out on release and now they become extremely good zenkai so that every time it's black black friday time they always and they have i think there was there a year before that um yeah so that they always give us the most phenomenal units black friday's that christmas banners just because they know we have that's because they know that is the most hype time to start some spending your crystals and summoning on banners um let me go back up here to the last just one yeah here it is guys just cause like yes i like if this is like they started off with hype and then they boost it onto that hype so guys black friday is gonna be hype and christmas last year is gonna be even more hype so guys you need to start saving your crystals now if you haven't saved you need, you need at least 30k minimum for this for this legends festival just if you want to either acquire um or max out like one cat one legend limited character or get all, all all of them just cause last year i remember spending 10k on this guy and getting here and getting everybody on this banner and then spending literally 20 10, 20k here and 10k here and not getting anybody but guys we, we need to learn from the mistakes so next time don't spend as well as guys you mustn't spend immediately as the banner comes out wait a little bit because i remember i spent all my crystals here when i when i really want if you had asked me which banner i would have wanted out of choice this guy the second choice of this guy but guys if you really um um but if you're really low on crystals and you can't and you're really free to play then you should wait because i remember that, like these banners literally stay here for like almost a month so if your black Friday banner comes out you should be able to wait for these two banners assuming that they're gonna do one two three like i love you should wait you should wait until these two come out and then wait until like the very last day for this one just so you can see which character best fits your team and which character you think you should be running so guys um yeah, those are basically the ad advice I'm giving you guys for all the free play players. Then for my guesses of which character I think they're gonna give us, mm, I definitely think they're gonna give us the same <laughs> and powerful opponent. But okay, I'm gonna this here. So based off how it should go, basically what I'm really looking for is um, let's see the tags. Let's see the tags that come so. So far, I'm thinking the cooler is gonna come for the Black Friday unit just cause we've gone so much into the cool, I love cooler. So he's gonna buff powerful opponent, limit of the movies. Uh, um, okay. So my prediction would be 
if I would have were to say that like they must buff a team in which um yeah they must buff a team in which really needs it um to be honest I only feel like the only teams in which really need it is like um uh, hey, girls yeah girls has literally girls literally does not have a proper team they literally just use the leftovers of other teams I mean like let's just quickly look at it. Yeah, but my first option would be tag girls just to pop them up a little bit a, li a little bit so let's just look at this for the red options what do we have one two three of the one two three she's good she's good uh they are good but the thing is she got future that dragon ball saga and she's fusions she's not really that good of a red but like, like you are you rather have large than her blue unit what do you have her Tenkai 21 and blue unit is more or less like she's meant for other teams, but you can, you can still squeeze her in there. Also, her she's meant for universal, universal survival saga, but still you can squeeze her in. Green, you have her and her. Mm. Everyone has bottles. These three, you can squeeze them in, but they don't fit into the tag. Uh, you can squeeze her in, but she doesn't fit in the tag. Uh, so for as well as Android 18. Red, purples. You can use her, but she doesn't fit in the team that well. And then, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Yeah, yeah, I really feel like they just need one LF character, then they'll be pretty much good to go. They basically have a full Kalu, but they're not that overwhelming. They're like just one LF character, maybe LF Kefla or, um, yeah, the only, yeah, LF Kefla, LF Brian or something, at least one LF character. Man, another one team that I was suggesting to start buffing hybrid saints. I'm just joking. I'm just joking, guys. I'm just joking. Um, yeah, the second team I would really say that needs a bit more love is no, mm -hmm, and we just future. Yeah, future really needs um, a future is not that desperate on buffs. Mm -hmm. I mean, I would really just say that. Uh, I see they have a blue, they have a red, they have two red, a blue, two red, a purple, a purple, a purple, yellow. Hmm, future just needs that one unit to just like make it solid good again, just cause right now, you really, you really can only can run future if you have them on high stars, but, besides all those guys, what? Um, um let's see. Oh, Super Warriors really needs a huge buff, just guys, just like, Super Warriors needs at least one LF unit, just cause, look at this tech, what do you have, you have the Piccolo, just Gohan, Zenkai, and the blue one, you literally only have Zenkai, Zenkai, Revival, and a good, decent, good unit, so, all they're missing, they have a blue, yellow, green, and red, all they're practically missed, they don't buff the attack, but at least they, all they're missing is a good purple and they'll be fine. Oh yeah, drone is there, but... Uh, like, we need something to make this tag literally boost, like, go up to the top team. I guess that's my opinion, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, I'll see you guys next time, peace. <laughs>